sentience, the world's hidden language of love. It's a language we commonly used, but never really realized we were speaking it. Unfortunately, it's dying. It's slowly leaving our existence, and we're straying away from our native roots. As humans, we have fallen into a trap of believing the world owes us everything, that every sentient being, every plot of land is our resource and was made for us. But really, we're meant to exist as one, not dominate over. We are killing our connectivity and continuity to other species. And slowly, we will have a world filled with mass-producing factories and not a single happy sentient being. You'll never see the same grace you used to when the deers would prance in the meadows and forests. You'll never feel the same joy and peace as you used to around a tall stallion or a bunny. Our lives will be black and white. Our forests will no longer be filled with the small burrowing animals or the tall trees who protected them. Instead, they will be dull and lifeless. There comes a time when we ask ourselves if we are dominators or collaborators. We are no longer living in the Ice Age. We need to protect our world and its sentience. Working with the greatest minds and hearts, we need to push for a transformation. So our future generations will have a world which isn't dead. Then only will these slaughterhouses and cages be a sad piece of the past. We can embark on a new journey in this world. So we can protect the world's sentience before it's gone. Now together, we need to support a change for the future. Otherwise, we will be left with nothing. The flowing rivers we visit in spring will be graveyards. The glaciers will be nothing but fallen water. But if we don't try, if we don't change what is now, there will be no us.